For the first time this season, the Bourne Braves have won not one, not two, not three, but four games in a row, just as they did to the Harwich Mariners. Beat them four times this season, a 4 nothing season series sweep in a 4-2 to two win tonight here at White House Field. It's a post-game edition of Tomahawk Talk. Ethan Frank, Max Stanzer, Calvin Christoforo with you. And Max, I just talked to Seth Keener. Five scoreless innings of relief. What a performance at the pen from him. Absolutely. Being scratched on Wednesday gets to face these Mariners after all. And the five innings, a season high for him, ties a season high in strikeouts with six, picks up his second win of the year both against Harwich as well he was just spectacular the pitching has really been the strength of this team down the stretch a four to three win on Monday four to three win on Tuesday two to one on Wednesday four to two tonight the offense it needs to come around a little bit when we get to postseason time but the pitching has been taking care of business and when you get into the postseason depth is the most important part and they've displayed that so far down the stretch here absolutely and Calvin the Braves have some depth on the offensive end as well they may have been held hitless for five and a third innings but breaking out in the sixth and Matt Horvath was the one that delivered the dagger yeah yeah, absolutely. It was a Braves team offensive approach tonight because really nobody in those first five or so innings had it. But how about John Peck, the big double to start this game? This is the first extra base hit for him in a couple of weeks. Ryan Enos had his first extra base hit. And then at the bottom of the order, Peck, yep. Espinal, a combined four for eight tonight. If you can get production from those guys to add on to the big boys because you know – that Matt Shaw's going to hit. You know Brito's going to hit. Slice's going to hit. Horbath is going to hit. Even Nelson Taylor has been really good in the leadoff spot. So the Braves offense coming together. The pitching once again stellar quickly into the top third of the league in ERA. This is a Braves team peaking at the right time going for a five-game winning streak tomorrow night in Chatham. Exactly what I was going to say. Peaking at the right time. The Braves have a chance to sweep their second straight opponent this season. That is when they go to Veterans Field tomorrow to face the Chatham Anglers. First pitch is at 7 tomorrow from the vet before the Bravos at 540, and we'll see you there.